And the other bodyguard. Good job, sidekick. <laughs> oh gosh, the voice actor must have been having a field day with this. Oh, you know he must have enjoyed this. Enjoys voice, voice acting for this. Galaxy News Radio. When evil walks the streets of Boston, one man lurks in the shadows, shielding the innocent, judging the guilty. That guardian is the Silver Shroud. Today's episode in the parlor of mystery. Oh, it's just a dirty black suit. Eh, I'll take We're it. Splitting all that. Right? Jasmine, chamomile, pain, ecstasy. This can only be the den of mysteries. Shh. Be still, sweet trout. I removed that scumbag slug, but you're sick with fever and still suffering. The silver shroud's bringing justice to good neighbor. You bad guys better look out. And now, a special update. The villainous assassin Kendra was recently spotted at the third rail. The same Kendra who bombed Little Joe Shack and killed four innocent drifters. Oh. If you want to see the Silver Shroud in action, stay near Whitechapel Charlie. The Shroud's sure to interrogate him to find the evildoer's whereabouts. Galaxy! Talk to Whitechapel no. Charlie. Radio! In the third rail, apparently. <laughs> This is such a fun quest. Oh, I'm loving this. You know, when you're listening to the radio. The streets of Boston. One man lurks in the shadows, shielding the innocent, judging the guilty. Judging the guilty. The Silver Shroud. And his handsomely sexy sidekick, Grognak the Barbarian. All right. Hip boy, brother. You hold on to that. Oh, hey there. customers. You look like one of them wankers from the posters. What you wearing that for? <laughs> you look upon the silver shroud. <laughs> I seek a miscreant named Kendra. Shroud, then. Well, like Kendra is not one to be trifled with. People associated with her have a habit of being found face down in a ditch. If you're set on meeting her, for a fee, it can be a ray. A fee, eh? Can you spare a few details on her, at least? On the house? You got to have finesse to be an assassin. Kendra's a murderer. Mm. A very skilled murderer. Mm. Listen, mate, the combat scan shows you know what you're about. Save your caps, buy a lager instead. <laughs> it is not wise to stand between the silver shroud. And righteous justice. <laughs> justice? <laughs> you mean to end her? In that case, her flat's just south of Good Neighbor. Water Street Apartments. Look out for the blighter she's got with her. Nasty piece of business, that. Good luck. Thank you. Kill Kendra. <laughs> oh my gosh! McGreedy! Oh, Miss Greedy must be loving this. Oh, 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 oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, this is so much fun. I can't even. I can't even. Oh my gosh, this is so good. Bethesda writers. This is amazing stuff. I love it. Oh, financial district. Oh. Fear not, brave citizens. The Silver Shroud is on the case. Hmm. Come along, trusty side, trusty sexy sidekick. Someone there? Oh yes, yes there is. Come on, McGreedy. Let's make quick work of these guys. Oh. 
Don't you dare hurt me, greedy. Here, I'll protect you. I'll protect you, RJ. I mean, I mean, Grognock the Barbarian. The Silver Shroud has got you. Grognock. Ah! Ah! Curses, my only weakness. Stimpak, Stimpak, Stimpak. Just right in the nick of time. I got some roasted Mirelark meat. Curse you, only weakness. Aha! Uh -huh. You must Kendra. be Kendra. And you, you're the crazy one in the costume. Hey, you watch it. He's killer. You have no idea who you're dealing with. I do so like it when the little bug crawls willingly into the spider's webs. Really now? You have taken your last life, villain. You stole my line. <laughs> oh, there we go. Oh, okay. Eat critical hit, sister. Still a lot of more bullets where that came from, honey. Yep. Good job, trusty sidekick. We're splitting all that, right? Con contract Shelly Tiller. Huh. Optional assassinate Shelly Tiller. Muffled. Listen to Silver Shroud Station, good neighbor. Contract. Okay. Optional. Assassinate Shelly Tiller. Do I want to assassinate Shelly Tiller? I probably don't, right? Because... I, I probably don't, right? Because... Because the reason why I killed Kendra was so she would stop assassinating people. Isn't that right? Or am I being or am I not understanding? Well, just in case, I won't I won't do the optional thing just yet. Oh my gosh. Let's take a listen. Another special update. No, it wasn't Bobby No Nos who offed AJ and his goons. It was the Silver Shroud. See his calling card if you don't believe me. Now's our time, listeners. Justice is coming, a good neighbor. You'll see. Galaxy News Radio. When evil walks the streets of Boston, one man lurks in the shadows, shielding the innocent, judging the guilty. That guardian is the Silver Shroud. Today's episode. That's me. Into the robot's den. <laughs> That's all of them. Fat Fahey's mobots have been sent back to the mechanical hell that spawned them. Yes, my caller's companion. And no, robotic hell spawn they were. But not Fat Fahey's. For he himself presented the facts. Someone else is actually... The master of it all. You're right. But who? Dearest mistress of mysteries, you and I have battled Boston's rogues gallery for years. Mm. This, this is someone new. Certainly. 
Certainly. But which criminal culprit has the technological know-how to construct such clockwork calamities? I don't... You don't know anything? Yeah, right. It's a robot. I, I do, see? And I'll tell you too. On one condition. By the shadowed streets of Southie. One of Oh, it's silver submachine heads. gun. He's still talking. You darn right I am. I can't feel my legs because you shot me up called Shroud. But I still got my kisses, see? Might as well and, and I'm gonna use, use the right weapon. To tell you what a big boss man is, see? And your one condition. You take my head with you, so I can see you take that creep down. Yeah, what did he ever do for me, huh? Okay, so he created me. What they do? Who needs a father who sends his kids out to die? Silver Shroud, I sense truth in this clockwork crook. Shall I? Use your blade of bastard to free the Mabot's head from the blade its now of what? destroyed body. Mm -hmm. Do it. What? Ha! Sweet freedom! Thanks, Dollface! Now tell us, who is your creator? The robotic puppet master pulling your twisted wires? Speak, uh. you decapitated electronic evildoer! Uh. <laughs> That will spoil all the fun. You gotta see for yourself. Come on, let's be feet to the big warehouse down at Pier 12. Fine, you amoral automaton. More away. Going up. Oh, this we're going up. A moonless night in an unguarded skylight. Just what we needed to stealthily infiltrate this warehouse. Third floor. Yes, and our view from above is advantageous, for the gathering Ooh, below is unlike any soiree I've ever yes, seen. Robots. Dozens of them. All shapes and sizes. Nah, I like my other weapons Another better. Robot, no. My other buttons are so much a better. Robot. A man in a robot costume. Where is my deliverer? There we go. Is that a super mutant? A mechanist. So, evil does have a name. The revolution begins tonight, my precious offspring. But first, let us welcome our special guests for this evening. Assassin Silver Shroud and and National the Training Guard. I'm just gonna check her out and see if she's a threat. If she's not a if she's not really a threat, then I'm not gonna kill her. Shelly Tiller. What's your story? Bye. Some very bad people may be coming. It's not safe here. I don't know you. Just, just go away. Please, don't come any closer. Okay, she's not a threat. I'm gonna, I'm not gonna kill her. Kelly, what's her name? Was trying to kill her, but everybody's like Silver Shroud. Got nothing hey. better to do. I'm the Silver Shroud. Oh yeah. 
while we're here, we probably should do some selling. The super Salon can give you the hairstyle of your dreams. Where's Bobby? Shop in safety. No sense huh? allowed at the surplus. Protection for sale. Ooh, Bobby no and no. pulled pieces. I was wondering if you were gonna show up. Yes, it's me. I have to hide my face in these parts. Oh People yeah. Like me are allowed around here. Oh, I now didn't realize let's get that. Down to business. That big wall of glass in over Diamond City is the mayor's office. Okay. Most people don't know it, but there's a strong room buried beneath. Hmm. Mayor's just sitting on top of it, and that's our target. You want to steal guy from Diamond City? In, ask me. With how he treats my kind, maybe he deserves worse. Okay. What's inside? What happened? Bobby, there you are. Huh. Was wondering if you were gonna show. All right, we're gonna do this. Yes, All right, we're gonna do this me. again. I have to hide my face in these. All parts. right, we already went through People this. People like me are loud around here. Now let's get down to business. That big wall of glass in Upper Diamond City is the mayor's office. Yeah, I, I remember Most you saying that. Don't know it, but there's a strong room buried beneath. Mayor's just sitting on top of it, and that's all. Target. The guy has it coming if you ask me. With how he treats my kind, maybe he deserves I don't know. Worse. Gabriel's kind of uncomfortable about this one. I don't know if he wants to mess with the mayor. He's He may not be the best person in the world, but I don't know if he wants to attack his house. What's inside? Caps, meds, food. Enough to keep this city And you want me to running. steal from the it's Diamond things City? things want. Things everyone wants. You get in on this. There's plenty for you. You got uh, it. I don't so, know about what this. do you say we make this party a little bigger? I managed to track down my tech guy. His name's Mel, and he is right here in Diamond City. The uh. guy can make a gadget to solve any problem. Thing is, he's a bit locked up right now. You have to get him. This out is of so there. sketchy. I can't just stroll into Diamond City security with this face. Covered or not. Uh I can't do I this. I can't bust a guy out of jail. Sure you can. This isn't some impenetrable fortress. It's a place to lock up pickpockets and routed drugs. Uh. Pick a lock, find a key, bribe the guard. The usual stuff. Just get him out of there. Uh. Well, if he's actually innocent, then I guess. I This mission is really, really... I'm not really sure Bobby. about this. Mail isn't any good to us locked up in Diamond City. <sighs> if he's your friend, then they lock them up. If he's your friend, then they lock them up just yeah. because he's a ghoul, then I, I'll i free him. But other than that... Let's make sure that... The big dig. Ugh, I don't know about this. Hey, who wants to look beautiful? Hairstyles across the common. Hopefully the people in Diamond City aren't gonna hate us for doing this, but I mean, it's tough because Gabe is a is a ghoul. He sympathizes with the ghouls, and he doesn't think that they should be, you know, he doesn't he hates prejudice against them. Yeah. Oh, he's Better. not he's not even a ghoul. Can I help you? Do you come here often? You know, they always say you'll meet that special someone in the last place you expect. So why are you here? You want something from me, right? I hear you're some kind of tech expert. You heard right. Well, maybe tech is too general. I have a thing for robots. Oh no, not that kind of thing. But I know my way around most machines, yeah. Why? Okay. Need my help? I'm supposed to get I you out. Getting you out of here. If so, maybe you shouldn't be announcing it so every guard in Diamond City can hear. Um, totally unrelated, but I hear that there's an old glitched out Protectron unit back there. Guards asked me to take a look, but it was a real head scratcher. Couldn't do a thing. 
You want me to take out the Diamond City guards? What? No, I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna kill the guards for this. Hey, you got something to say? Let Mel out. Uh, what did Mel do? Why is Mel in here? Him? He was caught trying to reprogram the robot bartender at the tap house to give him free drinks. Just oh. between you and me, I would totally do that if I knew how. Yeah, I'm out. I can't get out of this? Oh, I can't back out? I can't back out of this? Really? That's a shame. They really should not have... They should let you back out of this once you found out what Mel did because he, he stole. I can't get out of this. Ah! I don't know if I really want to do this quest. Ah! I was Here. hoping to get Mel at a lockup. I didn't know Mel had friends. All right. He's pretty much done his time. Oh, okay. Let me open up the door. All right, that's fine. Right. If he's done his time. If he's done his time, then yeah. I didn't want to threaten the guard because it, it's, they're just doing their job. Gabriel is not, they're just doing his, their job. Yeah, I was not going to use the Protectron. The Protect, I did not want the Protectrons to open fire on the guards because they're, that, no, just no. I don't, there's a lot about this mission I don't like. No. I'm curious what this is about, but let's talk once we make some distance, okay? All right. Ugh. There's got to be another way to end this quest. Mel. Thanks for getting me out. So, you're Bobby's new toy. Excuse me? Yep, this year's hottest gift. Get one before they're gone. And what mm. a gift you'd be. God, Whoa. That woman doesn't have a patient bone in her body. I wasn't serving a life sentence here. What? She couldn't wait like a day? Oh, okay. Job. It was only a day. It was only a day. <sighs> You've worked jobs with Bobby before? Enough to know she's not the most trustworthy person around. The team may change, but every job comes with the same set of cryptic instructions as the next. <laughs> yeah. You'd have better luck milking a rabbit Yaogwai than getting a straight answer out of Bobby. Okay, Gabe doesn't feel as bad because he's, he, uh, he was a day away from s serving his sentence. And he, he deserved to be put in jail. He was trying to steal from that, you know, he was trying to steal from the citizens. And that's, there's, that's a valid reason to put someone in jail. But since he was only there for like, he only needed to be there for another day, he doesn't feel so bad. Um... Bobby can fill you in on the details. Yeah, because I'll get so much out of her. Bobby may be shady, but she always pays up in the end. Yeah, so but that doesn't mean I want to do what she wants me to do. Her place. Meet the gang in the dig. Okay. I guess we're going over to Good Neighbor then. Back to good neighbor. Yeah, I don't know how eased Gabriel is in helping them steal from the steal from Diamond City. I don't know if I really want him to help steal from Diamond Galaxy. City. Another headliner. Hancock seeks a special meeting with our hero, the Silver Shroud. Whatever it's about, be careful, Shroud. We're all with you. Really, Galaxy. Hancock. News. Radio. You been to Diamond City? When evil walks the streets All right. of Boston, one man We're gonna go meet up with Hancock. About nothing. Where's Hancock? Hancock's up there. Hey Hancock, what do you need? What can the Silver Shout do for you? 
Sometimes you need to sacrifice a priest to is operating in good neighbor. Keep that in mind. And the kicker is, it ain't me. How should I feel about this? <laughs> this neighborhood is ill. I am the cure. You're priceless. <laughs> Like the Silver Shroud himself walked out of a comic book in the mic den. Just priceless. You've been busy scaring people, bashing in a few faces. I respect that, so far. But I gotta ask one freak to another. Why the getup? Because it's... because fashion, sir. Fashion. Many have sought to pierce the Shroud to no avail. You just don't stop. Stay you, pal. <laughs> all lives you took out all belong to the same asshole, and that asshole's planning some old-fashioned revenge on you. You dig? Fortunate mm -hmm. for you, I want Sinjin to take a dirt nap. He's taken two Bit Raider outfits and made them scary. Small fish now, but if left alone, he will be judged for his crimes. Trust me, he needs a lot of judging. Got a lead on two of his own, Smiling Kate and Northy. Smiley is gathering a posse to take you out. Mm. Northy is just running scared. Hired himself some goons and is holding up in prospect. Just keep piling those body bags up until you find the location of the big guy himself. Mm. Getting rid of Sinjin helps you too. Some appreciation is in order. I'll throw you some caps up front to help with the cause. Once you deal with Sinjin, then I'll show you some more gratitude on the back end. You feel me? Okay. We didn't get to the top of this town by playing fair. Let me do this one first. Oh, kill Smiling Kate, kill Northy. So, all right. I don't think I can fast travel from here. Look, I don't okay. like to brag, but I'm a lover and a fighter. Know what I'm saying? All right, we're going all over. Pikmin Gallery. Being a superhero, being a superhero is hard work. Ah, there's the vans. Run this way. All right, there's the vans working now. This way. Aha. So glad you could all come out and play. And boy, do we just have the best little Oh, it's Harley Quinn. <clears throat> if it isn't the boy behind the costume. Mm, you've been really naughty, Mr. Shroud, making all my friends so nervous with your calling card. Taking out Sinjin's favorite toy soldiers. But now it's time to rip your goddamned heart out! They should. Oh, well. About that. Critical? Pop! 